Okay, so in this problem, we know 3 fourths of some number plus 4 is negative 4. And I think the main concern here is to get rid of our fraction 3 fourths. I would do it in two steps. Uh, you can do it in one step by multiplying by 4 thirds. But I'm going to do it in two steps because it makes a little bit more sense to me. Um, so I'm going to multiply everything by 4. The reason I'm going to do that is because 4 times 3 fourths, well that's 12 over 4. Right, we multiply four times three on the top, and then divide by four, that's just three. In other words, these two fours cancel out, and that makes sense if you think about it. Three times four and divided by four, well, multiplying something by four and then dividing it back by four will leave you back where you started. They cancel out, so that's three n. Then we multiply by our next term, the one separated by the plus sign, four times four is 16. And finally, four times negative four. That's negative 16. Now, this is a little bit more manageable. I would subtract by 16 on both sides. And then I have 3n plus 16 minus 16 is 0. Negative 16 minus negative 16, excuse me, negative 16 minus 16 is negative 32. And n would equal negative 32 divided by 3. Well, 3 goes into negative 32, negative 10 times, with a remainder of 2, or 2 thirds, which is 0.6, repeating. All right, hope this helped.